I thought that when she was missing, we were going to find her. And I still said to everyone at the police station, when we find her, we can go for coffee at my house and she'll tell us everything. Right. And then we found out mm. that she had passed. They spent about almost the whole day, the whole Thursday with us. And the father was only supposed to take them the Friday. And then I said to him, it's his weekend, you know, doesn't he want an extra day with them? And that's why they left with him the Thursday night. Because of it being school holidays. The last thing I said to them is, love you, see you Sunday. That photo that's out with Jasmine, with the glasses, with Sarah with the glasses, yes. I saw that th th for the first time through public. If I'd seen that picture, I would have never let this happen. I would have, you know, been more cautious, done something. As I can see fear in my child's mm. face. You can mm. see she didn't want to be sitting by him. After everything happened, I saw him the next morning, and I said to him that I do forgive him, and I don't blame him. And we're a little bit distant now. He deals with things a lot different than what I do. I've grown up in a Christian home and I've just been brought up way differently. And the way he's been brought up, he deals with it a lot differently. He closes off to people where I can still speak. So we still do talk and we still have that good relationship. Just it's not the same since Jasmine hasn't been here. I'd like to know why, but I know the answers will never all be there. I went to the police station because I heard that uh, all of the people involved were going to get questioned. So I went with so that I could make sure they were getting questioned. I didn't want you know, anybody to get away with anything. And then they all went in for questioning one by one. And when her father came outside from being questioned, I asked him what was happening inside. And he said he'll talk to me now. And he spoke to his friend, which was sitting by the car. And then we heard a scream and uh, we ran to go check what was happening and that was when he confessed and the police climbed in the car with him in the car and they raced to the flat. And then church people came to the police station I said to them, please just get me to the flat, I want to go and see my baby and they wouldn't let us see our body. In the morning she woke up and we were all still crying and everything and she asked us why are we crying so I told her we heart sore because of Jasmine. And she said, we mustn't cry. Jasmine's by Jesus. Jasmine's happy. We must all stop crying now. Even when I put them in their own beds, mm. the two single beds, um, they wouldn't go to sleep. I used to struggle to get them to sleep. Then the one night I decided, that's it, put the two single beds <laughs> together. And they used to fall asleep holding hands. That's the only way they would sleep if they were close together.